Hey guys, what's going on? It's Ben here. It's the first weekend of December and me and Rachel are putting up the Christmas decorations and I thought it'd be a cool opportunity to do another little mini star vlog with you. Um, we're also going to be... See, every year I've always said to myself that I'd love to try eggnog, you see it on all of the American movies and whatnot, but we don't really get it over here in the UK. I've always said to myself I wanted to try it, but every year I've just never actually got around to doing it. So Rachel pulled off some ingredients off the internet. She went out and bought the ingredients and we're gonna be whipping up some eggnog today and we're gonna to be trying that for the first time. Um, and the dogs have also got a little present which they're gonna open. We subscribe to a, like it's like a monthly subscription thing. You get a mystery box every month just full of dog treats and toys. And that came this morning, so we're gonna be opening that up for them this, um, later on so they can get a little bit of an early Christmas present. So yeah, just stick around for some Christmas themed fun we're getting some Christmas um, some Christmas tunes on the TV that's certainly gonna get us into the mood so yeah just stick around guys for some Christmas fun so just pulled all the stuff out of the loft brought it down to the living room Cleo get and we're gonna put the tree up first yes yeah, so we're gonna sit the tree up first We've decided on that corner, yeah? Yeah. We put it on that corner. We put it in that corner last year. It looks okay in that corner. We were talking about putting it in front of these doors, but we let the dogs out um, of those doors, so blocking it would just be a bit of a nightmare. So we're going to stick it, sticking it back in the corner. Um, tree first. Have you guys gotten fed up? Fed up with it all already. Christmas tree is pretty much put up and done now and before it gets dark we're going to go out and put the ones out the front. We've got a couple of ones that we put out the front but we need to do it really quick because it's getting dark a lot super quick. Last year I had an absolute nightmare putting the lights up. So we have, a, we have a wreath on the door and we have one in this arch as well. Had an absolute nightmare. I stick them on using these like double sided sticky tape things. Um, but you have to cut the cable tie wire off. So I got it all stuck up looking really nice. Cut, um, went to cu uh, cut off the, you know, the, the, the excess strip, cut through the wire on the, uh, on the lights. So I set the whole thing down, buy a new one, put it back up. So I'm adamant I'm not gonna make the same mistake again.
I'd forgotten how much I'd hated that. Just got around to finishing all the Christmas decorations. Took about four or five hours, but um, now Rachel is preparing some eggnog, so it's going to be cool to try that for the first time. I'd like to think I'm going to love it, but I've got a feeling I'm going to hate it. It's got to be like Bailey's or something like that, so it should be fine. <laughs> The eggnog's got to be boiled. The eggnog's boiling. So in the meantime, we're going to give the dogs their monthly subscription treat box. Get one of these once a month. It's a blind box. Um, yeah, and they kind of know what when uh, what's in here and what kind of time this is when they see the box. They get all excited. So we're going to give them that now. What's in there, guys? Do you see what's inside? Leo, watch your face. So we've got a lot of treats and toys. So they've got some dental sticks for adults and puppies. Got a new tennis ball, Cleo. A squeaky lizard or lizard rope. Cleo. And what else have we got? Get your faces out, guys. Stop it. We have got some, what are these? Looks like turkey, turkey drummer stick things. Ow. And this looks like a chew toy of some sort. I'm not entirely sure what that is. And that's your lot for this month, guys. Do you want to open one of these up? Do you want, to, do you want one of these? Do you want one of these, boys? And Cleo. Come on, guys. Cleo. Leo. Cause you both them down quick. So Rachel's just finished mixing up and making this eggnog. I've never tried eggnog before, like I said before. It smells pretty funky, like cinnamony. Yeah. I know, you, yeah, I know you put cinnamon sticks in, but because because I've never had it before, I'm not. Sh I don't know what it's supposed to taste like, so I don't know if this is going to be horrible or or what. Is it like milkshake? It's really nice. It's just like a, milk, like a vanilla milkshake? Yeah. Is it? Mm 
Yeah, that's no. just, yeah, yeah. I was waiting for some kind of aftertaste or something. No, I was waiting for the um, the rum to kick me. Because um, usually, like, I, I'm not really a fan of rum, but you know, when you have like a, a short or something, yeah. you, you have to wait for that. That the it's warm. It's nice, isn't it? And, and it's not warm because it's um, it's pretty. It, it, it's actually like temperature hot. It's warm as in like because it's rum, you can you can still feel yeah. the warmth. Yeah, I like that. I don't think I would, but <laughs> I don't know whether I could have it a lot though. No, I think you'd be quite sick. Well, mind you, it's a festive thing. Everyone wants it, yeah. Yeah, it's just like a um, it's like a warm milkshake, and that sounds pretty sickly, but with a bit of alcohol. With a bit of alcohol, I do actually like that because I know you can buy it from um, Salvages, but I don't know what it'd be like, and I know it's expensive, but it's nice. No, it is actually nice though, as long as you don't neck it if you pace yourself with it. <laughs> yeah. No, well, you know, if you, it's not something you can drink. I think it's because it's like a milkshakey thing. It's got a milkshake plus um, the milk and stuff it's in it. It's milk. And yeah. Double cream. So you couldn't like neck it. So yeah, after twenty nine years, well, no, I haven't been saying for twenty nine years. I want to try eggnog. After twenty nine years of being on the planet, after what eleven years of being eighteen plus, I've always wanted to try eggnog. Um, yeah, finally got around to doing it, and it is. It's. It is. I'm glad we did it. It's. It's pretty nice to do. It's something different. If you do want to know the ingredients, ask me, and then I'll ask Rachel, <laughs> and she'll tell me, and then I'll tell you what's inside this. Because um, I haven't got a clue. But um, yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.